we just had conversations with coaches where they stressed the conversation is not about winning a championship. Uh, Stewie, I remember talking to you back in 2018 and you said, if we're not here to win a championship, um, why are we even here? And I just, I just really sort of wonder for you and really for all three, uh, Sam and JJ as well, how you balance those two things about, you know, Sandy says, winning the day with the type of expectations I know you hold, you all hold yourselves up to. Yeah, I mean, I think that there's a, a fine line uh, of that. Obviously, when you look at our overall goals for the year, it's to win a championship. I think that three of us up here will all agree on that. But that being said, that's not going to happen today, tomorrow, you know, the next couple of weeks. What's going to happen is we're going to create a standard and, you know, strive for excellence. And that's what's going to help us get to that point. Um so I think, you know, going off of what Sandy said, we are trying to win the day. We're trying to get better. We're trying to, you know, learn to play with each other really, really quickly. And it's crazy that it's been, you know, only a week of training camp. But what, in a little little over a week and a half, we're, we're starting. Uh, so we're just trying to get as ready as possible. And just off of that, Sabrina, for you, you know, this is an offseason where a lot of the conversation is about players coming in. You know, this, and we talked to Benajah a little bit about this, about what you guys have built. You know, how proud are you of what you have built here that has made this a destination for, you know, some of the best players in the world as well to be joining what you've built? Well, that's been the goal since I got drafted here, um, you know, was the understanding of having the backing of, uh, front office and organization that wants to bring a championship to New York City. And um, that's, you know, like Stewie said, doesn't happen overnight. You know, we started at the bottom and I've now worked our way into being this desirable team that two former MVPs want to come, you know, be a part of and, and be a big part of in winning a championship. And so uh, very thankful for, you know, the commitment from the front office and the organization to be able to make that, um, you know, make that come to life. And now it's our job to, to go out there and perform and build chemistry and, and do what we can in the pursuit of doing that. You both talked about New York being an attractive destination, not just for the basketball team that you were joining, but for the opportunities that would be available to you um, off the court. And I know it's early days, but I wanted to ask um, how those have materialized so far, um, maybe, maybe something specific about um, how that's come to life um, so far for you uh, being in New York? Um, I would say one of the ways that it's materialized was um, like our media day and stuff that we had to do yesterday. I mean, I feel like that was the longest day I've ever been in the gym or something like that. Um, <laughs> and I was pretty tired at the end, but, you know, big picture, it's good for our team and it's good for the league to have the coverage and, um, you know, everything that we had yesterday. So I think that was one of the ways. Um, just being around the city, I, I think I feel the energy of the people, um, you know, wanted to get behind this team. I'm being excited for the season. Um, and I just know that they're going to show up and, and be loud for us. And, you know, just all the other stuff that I've been able to do, obviously, like just not really marketability-wise, but like being able to go to Broadway shows and having the option to do things. So it's a big difference between Connecticut and, and New York, obviously. Um, <laughs> but, you know, it's going to take some time for more things to materialize, but I can already, I can already see a level of professionalism um, and, I guess, like more attention with us being here in such a big market.